It's a heavyweight showdown between the Black Beast, Derek Lewis, and Stipe Miocic. While the bonuses and the accolades have continued to pile up for one of the best heavyweights in the world, Stipe Miocic, and rightfully so. Of course, who can forget when he wrested the belt away from Fabricio Verdum in Brazil at UFC 198? And then what he did after the fact against Alistair Overeem and Junior Dos Santos put him on a pedestal as truly one of the best heavyweights of all time. And it should, because when you have those types of names on your resume, you will be considered one of the greatest fighters the division has ever seen. Stipe has the ability to win fights in a number of ways. Unbelievable boxer, has great footwork, but also was a division one level wrestler right. at Cleveland State University. Fights fires pretty well too. I'm He's really good at that. Yes, uh -huh. I went to the firehouse and it's intense as it comes. All right, so here is the Black Beast, Derek Lewis. It wasn't all that long ago that he beat Alexander Volkov, had won nine of 10, and earned a title shot against you in New York City. Derek Lewis back on the grind here tonight. Derek Lewis is a beast and one of the strongest guys that I have ever felt inside of the octagon. Every time his punches land, you can feel this unbelievable thud up against your head in the body and everything he does, it is just absolute power. He's a very, very good athlete as he shows with these double kicks that he always likes to throw up. Derek Lewis, when you win nine out of 10 fights, you're a monster. And he is on paper one of the more prolific knockout artists this division historically has ever seen. The Black Beast, ready to get back to it here tonight. Or tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Mia Chich is two years his senior. Lewis weighed in at 260 pounds. Mia Chich will have a one inch reach advantage. All right, now to get us started, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 20 wins, four losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds, fighting out of Independence, Ohio, Stipe Miocic. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 26 wins, 10 losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds, fighting out of Houston, Texas, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? All right, so here we go. This highly anticipated fight is now underway. Looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler. Am I simplifying things too much? In this instance, you aren't, because this is what got these two men to the show. Right. One guy is known for his diverse attack on the feet. The other guy is known for his ability to drag the fight to the mat and put his opponents in danger from the very start of the grappling exchanges. 
ball, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed. Right there. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Miacic has got the tie clinch now. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Ooh, what a punch. Nice head kick. Unable to connect with the right hand now. Big kick land. Nice knee to the body there by Miacic. Put the guard beautifully there. Good right hand from the top. Miacic gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Oh, big head kick. Nice shot by Miacic on the feet, making some adjustments, and man, that jab looks clean tonight. I mean, that jab looks clean, but you gotta be very careful not to get hit with a steep Amy Ocean's right hand. It's powerful, it's straight, and it can be very damaging. Swing and a miss by the heavyweight Miacic. All right, under three minutes now to go in round one. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for the Black Beast, Eric Lewis. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure. So doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight. And if you're trying to slow your opponent down, Mission accomplished so far. When you can land that many leg kicks, you start to affect... That one appeared to stun him. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, straight right. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. Miancic gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Under two minutes now to go. Punches block. Lewis gets caught with that punch. It's such a fast leg kick. Ooh, Ooh we what a right hand by this young man. If you're going to leave your body that wide open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, big punch land. Straight right hand, no good. All right, 60 seconds now to go in round one. Straight right, he misses. Miacic gets absolutely torched by that uppercut. That one figures to leave him off. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, he got absolutely bludgeoned. and that's as good a combination as we have seen out of him here tonight. The last time I saw a combination this good, it was Donald Cerrone beating up on Rick Stewart. Ten seconds now in round one. Just misses there with the left. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Right now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. 
both displayed great technical skills. Unbelievable strike. All right, back to the live action now, DC, as we get to the start of round two. The Black Beast, Derek Lewis, versus Stipe Miocic. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at the cheap throws is crazy. Wind it up on the right there to know that. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Straight right hand now, just misses. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Real quick leg kick. Wow. Stuff to take down, no problem. Oh, strong punch there by Miocic. Put the guard beautifully there. Way to hide that leg kick. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Over and over, he's landed his big body kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combination, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. 72 total strikes have landed for Derek Lewis. And connecting with 29% accuracy if you're scoring at home against Stipe Miocic. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Great punch. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Two minutes to go round two. Miocic's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Nice kick. Right hook to the head block. Caught that kick there. Very nice leg kick there by the Black Beast. Oh, that's a nice strike. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Well, no surprises. He connects once again, and that looked like a landing right on that cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking. You can see him almost putting a laser beam on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much. He just keeps making it split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. Seconds now to go in the round. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Nice punch there by Lewis. Pretty good knee to the body by Miocic. Put the guard beautifully there. Oh, 
and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by the Black Beach. Oh! Man, these guys are throwing yeah, back right so far. All right, so we now look back into the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All right, DC, here we go with our next round, and we'll see if he can pick up where he left off. High volume of strikes landed in the previous round. High volume of strikes landed. He was able to be accurate, but also very, very active in his approach to the start of this fight. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Lewis gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Whiffs on the uppercut there. Gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. A little single collar tie there. Miacic's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to fight down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. The numbers 122 total strikes have landed for the Black Beast Eric Well, the accuracy not great, DC, landing at a 31% connection rate thus far against Stipe Miocic. Straight punch lands. Oh! Huge right hand! He's hurt. Throws him up. Go get him. the left there. Just reached the midpoint of the fight. Got the single collar tie. Pretty good right hand. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. What a punch. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Two minutes to go in the round. Trying to hammer that lead leg. He blocks the punch. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Oh, and he connects with a the punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch him punch like this puts a smile on my face. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. to the jab now, no good. No! He's in trouble. No! He's hurt bad. Holy smokes, he put it to sleep. Oh, and that is it. Referee has seen enough and maybe 
so have we. Your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. Take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched one. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 17 seconds of round number three. We're playing the winner by knockout, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight he did exactly that. Congratulations.